Hello everybody, I'm back at the Oya Salt Pond today with a couple of my cousins. They were nice enough to drop me off. So I'm here getting some more footage. This is an excellent place. The last short that I did of the salt pond was uh, at a cousin's wife's retirement party. So we only had limited time to come here. Uh, on my big camera, as you see over here, I'm getting uh, some B-roll for uh, maybe some ASMR for those who like listening to the surf. So after that's color corrected, I will upload that and hopefully you guys will enjoy that. But let me just show you some footage of this beautiful salt pond. Now, as I said in my first video, my shorter video, salt pond was formed by volcanic lava coming down from the Soufre volcano during one of the many eruptions it's had over the, over the course of its life. And the lava, all of these rocks you see are dried lava. And it's very sharp, so if you come over here, wear some good sturdy water shoes or something, because falling on these will really cut your skin to ribbons if you're not careful. And uh, the salt water from the ocean comes in and fills up the water in the pond and the water stays and eventually dries out or goes back out with the tide. I'm unable to get a video of the water at this time but right there that's one of the areas where the water comes into the pond and replenishes the water from across the surf. So the surf hits the rocks on the other side which we can't see and the water trickles into the pond and refreshes what the and catches what's here. There's your little history lesson for the day. And you can walk all the way out to where that young man is above there. And I think you can dive, but I'm not sure. But people love coming here with their families and soaking in the water. It's really nice. It's a nice experience. But take in some more of the surf. Let me see if I can't get a little closer while my camera works on the other end. Just look at that. That's just gorgeous. The water is so nice and blue here, much unlike our vomit green water we have back in New York. And I hope I'm not stepping into my own video on the big camera, but I think that I am. But at this point, I don't care anymore. This is just too pretty to miss. I think next time I come here, I'll just bring my big phone gimbal with me, I mean my big camera gimbal with me and work with the big camera for the whole time. With luck I'll be get, get better at color grading and I'll be able to do some better work with it. But this I could sit here and just on a rock and watch this for hours and hours. It's so relaxing just to watch the surf and the pretty water. It's really cool. There are my two cousins up on the hill at the top of the top of the rock there hanging out and having a good time i'm not much of a climber and i don't have the right shoes for it so i'm not going to try it my feet are slipping or slipping and sliding around all inside these shoes so the last thing i need to do is fall and hurt myself on the couple of days before my vacation is actually finished so i'm just going to stay over here where it's safe and get some good footage from a distance <laughs> 